Every year, five million Australians are affected by mental illness, and every day, eight Australians take their lives. We gave a pair of artists, one established and one emerging, both touched with mental health challenges, eight hours and a one-word brief to create a work of art around mental health. Each hour represented the lives lost each day in Australia to suicide. Easel to easel, back to back, art to art. Two strangers, two artworks, one big conversation about mental health. When you're lost in the process, time is gone and you're consumed with the, the creation of it, I suppose. You're just lost in this zone. I'm Sean Leahy, I'm the cartoonist for the Courier Mail newspaper, my day job, and I'm a painter and artist and writer as well. <laughs> my name is Sam. I'm an artist of sorts. I use a computer, so like this is this is all a bit new, but like I did do it in uni, so I know the theory and stuff, so hopefully I haven't forgotten it all. I think discovery is the best word for the, the whole process. Today, I think we're going to discover a lot more about ourselves and about each other. A little story, I was having a meltdown on the train. Um, and it was kind of because like, I'd put myself into a bit of a corner, to be honest. I was like, like the idea was to really challenge myself today because um, I do believe in trying to put yourself in an uncomfortable position to you know, encourage growth. <laughs> Whether I get it done on time, might be a bit of a mad rush. Look, I think painting in the presence of another artist is actually, is actually quite motivating, even if you don't see what they're doing. I had a, an episode um, of depression about 2013, so I'm very aware of the, you know, the, the struggle of depression. And it, it's partly what moved me into painting. It's kind of nice just to realise that there's other people in like a similar or the same kind of situation you're in. You know, it's a bit of camaraderie. So how are you going? Yeah. Now I'm disappointed in what I've come up with, you see, so, yeah. <laughs> Where you're disappointed? <laughs> so far, yeah. yeah. Well, the, the images that I'm trying to, you know, the bit that requires my brain. Yeah. Is... I, I think I'm just like also a bit hesitant to actually start. But it's been so long since I've actually really played around with paint and mm -hmm. acrylic and stuff. You can have the plan and follow the plan, mm -hmm. but it's great to have an accident in the middle of it. Or do I make it into a, a feature? Yeah. This accident or not? I don't know if I could do that. Be like, well, that's, ah, that's, uh, I shouldn't have mixed colours. That would have. But that's an okay thing, isn't it? I mean, no, because it, it, it's like a too arty. I wanted to be like blocks of colour. Oh yes, yeah, you flat know? colour. Yeah. Flat colour. Yeah, I had a, a bit of a breakdown because I totally messed up, and so now I'm going to go digital because that's you know my tried and true. Sorry, Sean. It's okay. I know how you feel, so don't fret. Oh wow, that's fantastic. Like, how'd you get, is this with a spray bottle? Um, well, I, I put the paint on first, mm -hmm. you know, in, in, in thick clusters. Yeah. And, uh, you know, I put all the different colors that I wanted in the different areas. And yeah, then sprayed and it runs. Mm. Um, but I, I turned the canvas around and held it, you know, this way. And, that's and, right, yeah, so you did Designed that. where it was running. Because I knew I wanted this kind of light to dark and and you know the light at the end of the tunnel kind of thing. Yeah. Well, I, I, I like that uh, if I stand back. Um, oh, let's try it, standing uh, back. I, I know you're not supposed to pick favorites, but I just really love that top corner. So, um, just like in terms of the brief discovery, hmm. I kind of didn't take it the same. Oh, I obviously didn't take it the same way. I kind of focused or well, interpreted it as like the journey and stuff. Yep. Yeah. So like. Oh. <laughs> Certain doom and humiliation. <laughs> this is kind of what is ahead, like 
objectively, like you're gonna get humiliated from time to time. Mm -hmm. Certain doom is, you know, death. We're all, like, gonna, we're all gonna die. Yeah, exactly. Death. So we, we could say this is a very optimistic view of life. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you, if you want, I finish, so I'm happy as. But the thing is, looking at it now, I kind of wish I continued as a painting. It wasn't as bad as I thought it was. So that's a dis discovery too, isn't it? Yeah. 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 That you, uh, you catastrophized about your paintings. <laughs> and it wasn't that bad. You can tend to be a bit isolated in these kinds of circumstances. Asking for help is, is a, a, a big ask sometimes, but it's, it's worth it. And if this gets that message out, great.